Terrifying moments caught on camera in a Phoenix neighborhood. Officers rescuing a family from a home that had just been broken into by a man they were trying to serve warrants on. He was running from police at the time. Tonight, that suspect is behind bars. Fox 10's Irene Snyder joins us live to sort this all out. This was chaotic. It was scary for sure. That's exactly right, John and Christine. And you can see as they're in the video that we'll show you in a little bit just how terrifying it was. You can hear the screams from some of those family members of the police. Mem police were trying to get them quickly out of the home. Now, police say that that man that they have ended up arresting had meth and a gun inside his car at the time. And neighbors say that this happened in an area that normally is very quiet and peaceful. Vamanos, let's go. A harrowing rescue. We'll protect you from us. Body cam footage shows Phoenix police helping this family of three escape out their window. This after a man ran into their home near 35th Avenue and Deer Valley Road. According to court documents, police were pursuing this man, later identified as 32-year-old Demetrius Fortier Cathay. He was wanted on multiple felony warrants. He first fled in a vehicle. He abandoned that car, and that's when he ran into this home. Tim White lives two doors down from where this happened, and he watched it all unfold. But we saw that the guy heard that it's good, and they came over and almost thought it hit the SUV. And we looked at the neighbor, he's checking it out, and next thing you know, helicopters overhead and telling us to get in the house and lock the doors because they're bringing the canine in. Floyd says it's normally a pretty quiet neighborhood and he's never seen anything like this happen there before. It's actually a really good neighborhood. It's just, uh, you know, for Deer Valley. And police did have to go in to get Cathay. He did not come out on his own. He is now facing several charges, including endangerment and resisting arrest. Reporting in Phoenix, I'm Irene Snyder for Fox 10 News.